What's up, everybody? This is Apparition here. I'm gonna take a look at an indie game called Black Ice. So basically, this is a hacking game. And what you do is, all these buildings are different evil corporations that you're going to hack into. And it's also, it's like a first person shooter. And uh, let's see, these, le these levels are kind of like automatically generated by the game. They're not like pre-rendered by like, you know, like the developer or whatever. So as you see, like you have your health, you have your RAM. You spend your RAM on things like, things like shooting, yeah, shooting costs RAM, hacking, all that other, th all that other stuff, you know, that would cause, cause, cost you some RAM. So different buildings have different difficulties. So, uh, here we go, here's a, here's a three, so let's do something easier. So once you start hacking, all these monsters are going to come out. This is hacking. Hack to the building. Grab your reward. Uh, let's see. So when you hit T, kind of opens up your your stats here. So like whenever you level up, you can add to your stats. Let's just give myself a little more weapons damage. Confirm. Uh, e opens up your inventory. So apparently that's what I got as a reward. So, let's replace that. Let's hack into the building. I shouldn't mess with the tent until I get some better items. Let's see, we got a common shotgun frost bolt. So you can throw that and hotkey it at key one. And uh, give that a shot. Actually, let's just see what it does. Oh, that's cool. I've never seen that before. Um, I think in this demo. You can only get up to level four. Oops, there's the there's the main big building. You don't want to mess with that. Five hundred difficulty.
Jesus Christ. Uh oh, I died. Lame. Where was I? Was it this one? I can do better than that. Come on. Same shit. Sprinting is not much different from actually running. Alright, let's step it up a bit. Let's try a 10. Oh shit! That's way bigger. Cap that four already. All right, let's see what else we can do. Let's uh, get some more damage here. No, I don't get to. All right. Okay. Whatever, motherfucker. Let's go for a 34. Well, that's it. 
that's it. That's that. But anyway, yeah, this world is pretty gorgeous. Um, it's not really pre-rendered, so it'll kind of like regenerate probably every time you come. Uh, there is multiplayer, but uh, apparently you have to pay or buy the game. I'm actually not even sure how much it is. I just kind of randomly stumbled across it and I thought it was pretty awesome. I probably will end up buying it or voting for it on a Steam green light because it is quite good it's quite fun and it's pretty gorgeous I kind of love like the whole I don't know I've always been really into like cybery neon worlds Tronish type shit so it's pretty awesome anyway that's it peace out